deal from here on, huh? Looks easy to get lost in. Can you all hear me? Whoa! Is that you, Senpai? I'll be providing audio backup from here on out. Keep that in mind. Wait, are you saying you can see this place from all the way out there? It's my persona's ability. The structure of Tartarus actually changes from day to day. I'd like to join you up there, but we need someone to provide outside support. That's even more concerning. Now, based on your current location, you can expect to encounter enemies at any time. This shouldn't be too tough, but proceed with caution. You'll get the hang of it as you go. Right. Got it. Why is she always like that? Right. Let's begin. Defeat all the shadows on that floor. I'll support you as much as I can, but it's up to you to learn something out there. Hold on. There's a shadow up ahead. First real battle for Takeba and Iori. Proceed with caution. All right, let's start by going over how to attack shadows. When faced with an enemy, you have two primary options for fending them off. The first option is to use your equipped weapon. The second option is to use your persona. But remember, every persona has its own strengths and weaknesses. Knowing how Persona's work will be crucial. Try summoning yours right now. Right here, shadow turn up out direction. Seize the moment they destroy the nation. Round slow motion, give me motivation. Break out now, tear them around. Round the around, spit out all over. Round the components, don't come in a crowd. Watch out the moon, they sit out. Guess what this sound of bombs all ground. So round up, don't eat your pace. Brutal, moment of truth, there ain't no truth. You're the only one, one world, one love. But the radical shit is never so fast. Destruction. Okay, looks like I'm a... Here goes. Check this out! Well done, Iori. Considering it was your first battle, you did well. Talk about two. You'll be fine. Don't be afraid to show what you can do. Got it. Good. Let's continue exploring. Another shadow up ahead. Let's get you more accustomed to combat. The battle's about to begin. Everyone, stay focused. All right, next, let's go over a useful approach for defeating enemies. Most enemies have an elemental affinity that they have low resistance to. Targeting weaknesses is one of the best ways to deal damage. Not only that, it can also knock enemies down. Knocking down an enemy creates an opening, letting you continue your offense. Weaknesses, huh? Done. I'll show you how it's done. Wait, let me 
handle this one. Just point it to my head and pull the trigger. I can do this! Oh, you're not so bad yourself, Yukatan. That's it, Takeba. You give it a try as well. Work, Takeba. You performed as well as I hoped you would. Totally. I can take my eyes off you. Can you try not being a creep? Great. Looks like everyone's gotten used to handling their personas. Leader, take note of each member's strengths and conduct the battle accordingly. I can still sense some enemies around. Let's move on. looking thing yes boxes like those seem to be scattered all throughout Tartarus sometimes they contain useful items for battle seek them out as often as you can oh sweet so they're basically like treasure chests hell yeah let's bust it open and see what's inside Looks like it'll be useful. It's up to you to decide how to use it. detected. Looks like they haven't noticed you yet. Now's your chance. Try sneaking up on them from behind. Make sure you stay out of their field of vision. you've identified. If you ever forget an enemy's affinities, just let me know and I'll get that data for you. An all-out attack. An all-out attack? 
It's a maneuver that engages the entire team in a coordinated assault when all enemies have been knocked down. Naturally, the enemy has no way of defending against this. It's one of the most reliable means of attack. Whoa! That sounds so badass! Let's give it a try right now! Our all out combo attack, you filthy shadows. When I saw my opening, it's like my body just knew what to do. That was magnificent teamwork. It's hard to believe it's your first time. As you grasp the flow of battle, you'll learn to coordinate with each other seamlessly. Let's apply what we've learned so far and continue exploring. Detect another shadow up ahead. Take advantage of what you just learned. Try not to alert the enemy as you move. I've covered the basics of combat now, but the most important thing is making decisions based on the situation at hand. I'll continue providing support, but this time, go ahead and try fighting on your own. You, my boy, are able to possess multiple personas and summon them at will. The enemy has been defeated. Excellent work. Um, 
was that? Well, it looks like he has the ability to summon different personas. I suspected as much after the events from the other day, but now we know for sure. All right. what Takeba said. Please prioritize getting back safely for now. Your chest looks different from the one before. Yes, that particular box is sealed in a special way. The box can be unlocked by its own mechanism, but it needs something else to work during the dark hour. What's that you got there? Like you found a teleporter. Now use it to return to the entrance. Welcome back. So, how was it? I see. Well. If you gained confidence, that's the best thing you could have achieved. Wow! I never knew I had that kind of power! But damn, why do I feel so exhausted? Because you were bouncing around like a little kid. You say that, but you look pretty tired yourself, Yukatan. This is different. It's like I'm having trouble breathing. What's going on? That's the effect of the Dark Hour. You'll become fatigued more easily. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. I have to say, though, I'm surprised. You all did much better than I expected. At this rate, they'll catch up to you in no time, Akihiko. <laughs> we'll see about that.